Hey guys, and welcome to Stardew Valley. I'm going to make a character... Animal preference dog or cat dog? Favorite thing? I don't know. I'm gonna make a girl. Oh, that's so pretty. Name, as I always do. Farm name. Favorite thing? Sushi? I'm just gonna do that. Fish. Skin. I'm very pale, so I'm just gonna go well, not what? Bl what? Blue and green, purple, yellow hair. Oh, that's cute too. Pigtails. No, I wanna see what I'm doing. Princess Leia-ish. Oh, that's cute! Oh well, let's go for 22 because that's so cute! Okay, so this is gonna be my character. Nice! Because it's so cute! Alright, okay. Grandpa? Santa? And for my very- oh, very special granddaughter. Oh no! I want you to have this sealed envelope. No, don't open it yet. Have patience. Oh, Grandpa! Now listen close. No. There will come a day when you will feel crushed by the burden of a modern life. And your bright spirit will fade before growing emptiness. Before growing emptiness. What? Thanks. Thanks, Grandpa. When that happens, my dear, you'll be ready for this gift. Oh, Grandpa. Now let Grandpa rest. Like, for real rest? Like, for dead rest? Or what? Oh! <laughs> Work. Rest. Join us. Thrive. So we're in cubicles and there's two people mod- Oh my god! We're monitored everywhere our desks are filthy life's better with Georgia oh hi oh that's my friend I think I hope she seems nice where's my eyes oh I was sleeping Dear Siggy, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I had lost sight of what mattered most in life, real connections with other people and nature, so I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I have enclosed a deed to that place, my pride and joy, Siggy's Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, dear. Good luck, love, Grandpa. Like he knew it would be mine. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? Okay, I don't know who Lewis is, but sure. Loading. Loading. Oof. Beep beep. On the bus again. Sure is a green and bright place. New Valley, 0 0.5 miles. Hi, Birdie Boo. Okay. Let's get a flat tire, or they just leave, let me out. Hey, Robin. Hello. You must be Siggy. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Major Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. Really? The mayor's tidying shit up for me? And also, Mayor Lewis? 
Grandpa's friend. The farm's right over here if you follow me. Okay. Oh. Ah, I see there's lots of stuff to be done. This is Siggy's farm. What? What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. Sure, of it will be just fine. Those pigtails! So cute! And here we are, your new home. Hello! Ah, the new farmer! Hi, Lewis! Mayor, Major, Mayor Lewis! Welcome, I'm Lewis, Mayor of Pelican Town. Pelican Town? I thought it was Stardew Valley. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. Okay. So, you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house. Very rustic. Rustic? Rustic? I don't know. That doesn't sound very good. Apart. Rustic. That's one way to put it. Crusty might be crusty. Might be a little bit more apt though. Rude. Oh. Oh snap, Robin. Don't listen to her, Siggy. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. Oh. Oh. <gasps> hmm. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. The townspeople would appreciate that. What if I don't? Meh. No, it's okay. I'll do that. This is my mailbox. Yeah. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. What? But that's not a little bit weird? That is quite a little bit weird. <laughs> quite a lot a little bit weird. So, well, good luck! Creeper? Such a creeper! What? Oh, it's a big box. Oh, not the mailbox. Ah, <laughs> oh, it is really cute. WASD! Shift and check. What's check? Check the bed. Check the bed. Oh. Check what? Oh! Decorative bowl. Can you place inside your house? Well, let's just keep it on, on there then. Uh, TV. No, 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 no. Keep it there. That's fine. No, stop. No, oh my god. Really? What am I doing? I just wanna... Oh, there we go. Weather report. Welcome to whatever. Kozu 5, your number one source for weather, news, and entertainment. And now, the weather forecast for tomorrow. It's going to be clear and sunny all day. Thank you. Oh, parsnip seeds. A new journal entry. You received 15 parsnip seeds. There's a little something to get you started. You went inside my house in the night? Or what? Huh? Weirdo. Alright, let's go. Uh, what? Journal F. It would be a nice gesture to introduce yourself around town. Some people might be anxious to meet the new farmer. If you want to become a farmer, you have to start with the basics. Use your hoe to till the soil, then use a seed packet to till soil, soil to sow a crop. Blah. Water every day until the crop is ready for har harvest. Okay. Let's do that then. Where's the hoe? Do I have um, a well 
somewhere? Where would it be? Well, well, well. Oh, there's water. What? That's one creepy box. Alright, so this is the town, I guess. Let's not use anything in my hand. Have it oh. This. Look at this. Pelican Town. Okay, this way. Oh! I actually have an energy level. Hey, bro. Who are you? You look nerdy. Hi! Harvey, it's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. Hi, Doc. I perform regular checkups and medical procedures for all the residents of Pelican Town. It's rewarding work. Oh, cool. Can I, uh, harvest these? Okay, I guess not. So I found the doctor. What the fuck was that? Let's check the doctor's office. Nobody in here. Okay, wait. You're not a good enough friend with Harvey to enter his bedroom. What? Oh, someone's birthday? Oh my god, I have to keep an eye on people's birthdays? Oh, what? Hi! Hello, you must be Siggy, the new farmer. I'm Caroline. Hi. My husband runs the general store here, and have you met my daughter Abigail? She's the pale one with the purple hair. Spring is lovely. Okay. Hi. For sale. I want to talk to you, bro. Hi. Pierre. Hi, it's Miss Siggy, the new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I'll also buy produce from your from you for a good price. A little agriculture could really inject new life into the local economy. Twenty-four slots. That would be cool. Twenty-two thousand dollars. Okay, none of money. Okay. I don't know where to find your daughter. I don't know if I'm allowed to go in here. Oh hi, I am. Hello. Can I? Oh, oh, snooping, snooping. To Mr. Pierre, it pains me to be the bearer of bad news, but I feel obligated to inform you of a recent development most threatening to your livelihood. Georgia Co. has decided to expand into Pelican Town. It's too late for your protest. Georgia builders have already broken ground for the new Georgia Mart. This must be devastating news for you. So many years in business and local standby, and now obscured by the shadow of powerful, efficient, economically, economically viable corporation. What a shame. As manager of the new Georgia Mart, I feel to some degree personally responsible for your predicament. As such, I'd like to offer you a position as assistant grocer. Wages start at 5G an hour. I look forward to seeing your resume. Oh, bitches! Holy, what? What is this place? Is this like a churchy thing? What? Altar of Yowa? <gasps> I don't want to look at people's mailboxes. I do, but I don't. Or trash. What? Oh, acorn. Mine. Why would someone throw away a perfectly good acorn? You clean up the town too. But why though? Hello? This doesn't look very, uh, open. It's locked. Okay. Ooh, shovel! I can grab? Where the hell am I? Oh, it's almost 7! 7 p.m. Jojen Mart. <gasps> Is this open? Hi. 
Welcome to Jojo Marked. How are you doing today? I don't believe we've met. I'm Morris Jojo, customer satisfaction representative. When you decide you want to become a Jojo member, I'd be delighted to help you make your transition into a joyous experience. Joyous experience. Oh. Oh, another thing. Major Lewis promises that if anyone else joined up, he'd let us turn that old community center into a Jojo warehouse. Isn't that wonderful? No. I don't want to join. Why do I want to join? Hi, lady. Can I talk to you? Oh, I have to go home. Getting dark. Hi, dog. Hi, dog. There is no dog. It's locked. Oh, shit. Saloon. Come in, come in. Hello. Clint. Hey, I am Clint. I'm the town blacksmith. If you ever need upgrade to your tools, I'm your guy. Thanks, Clint. I don't know you. Why are you talking to me? Fuck you, Shane! Hello! Hi, kid. Name's Pam. Hey, kid. I'd buy you a drink if I could afford it. Well, hello there. I'm Gus, chef and owner of the Starter of Saloon. Hi there, Siggy. I'm glad to see you. You're always welcome here. Emily. Oh, I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Is this where my home is? No, this is where the bus stop is. Why are there no lights in town? So, until what time am I allowed to, um, to work? Seeds, fiber, can't freaking see anything though. Oh, I need to sleep. I need to sleep. I believe I have to go back home. There we go. Sleep? How do I sleep? How do I sleep? Go to sleep for the night. Yes. Your progress has been saved. Thank you. Oh! Stuff has been watered or been growing. Oh, I like the music. So cute. Okay, my axe isn't strong enough to break this stuff. Alright, well, let me fix up my water. And I'm going to end this episode here because I am all out of time for this one. So thank you guys very much and I will see you guys in the next episode of Stardew Valley. Bye!